right, Scarborough Fair. So this is one of my favorite melodies. It's been recorded many times by many different artists. Uh, probably one of the most popular ones would be the version by Simon and Garfunkel. One of the interesting things about this melody is it's in the Dorian mode. All right, so Dorian mode is the same thing as natural minor, except with a raised six. So here's natural minor. So if we raise the sixth note up a half step, it turns that C into a C sharp. So here's Dorian. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then back to, to one. The score and tab is available at my website, so check it out. All right, so here it is very slowly. So we're gonna start off with just the middle finger down. Alright, so for this arrangement, the melody is going to be the highest voice. And so I bring it out a couple different ways. One, just by using rest stroke, um, which is what I did in that when I played through it that way. Another way is I just try and hit that note a little bit harder. Um, but you want that to come out over the accompaniment. So here it is with free stroke. Here it is slowly, beginning measure six, we've got. All right, and here's measure 12. All right, so if you take a look at that measure, it forms a D major chord. So you've got this. I don't put that whole chord down at once, but I just go one at a time. But that is a D major chord. So starting there. All right, to make it longer, what I'll do is I'll take a repeat. So I'll do everything but that very last measure and go back to the beginning. On the repeat, I do try and play it a little bit differently. I might play it more upon a cello, which is closer to the bridge. Or I might play it more dulce, so that's more up here. The idea is just to play a little bit differently to keep your listeners engaged. Beautiful piece of music. Good luck and let me know if you have any questions.